guys, today I'm going to talk about the monthly MTG line box. Uh, it's been a while since we received the box, so let's go ahead and see what we got. Uh, lots of Hello Kitty stuff, because that makes sense. Let's show you the box. There's actually three different boxes here. Four different boxes. Um, one of them came with just very expensive uh, Totoro's. They're $16.50 a piece. And they came with all these blue, unique Totoro's. And then the box here is really heavy. And as you can see, I'm kind of opening the Hello Kitties. So we have, I guess I should do this box first. So the, you have the Totoro's that came in uh, one of the boxes. You have this Moskin messenger bag, which is really nice. Um, the quality is extremely high. And yeah, I'm glad you can take this bag to Friday Night Magic and not feel, you know, not feel too bad about it. It's a very high quality moleskin bag. I think it was a hundred plus dollars as this Pikachu was just like giving me a lot of trouble. Um, so yeah, let's take it out. So it's a really nice uh, messenger bag. It actually converts into two different types of bags. One for women and one for men. According to this picture at least. So, pretty cool. Uh, definitely a nice bag to put your binder in for uh, Friday Night Magic, etc, etc. So I'll put that away. I'll move this box over here. So in this box we had just tons and tons of Hello Kitty, which is a great speculation at this current moment in time. And then box, I guess I'll put them, I, you can't even see it. Box after box after a box of Eldric Moon, which I will make a video about in soon. Well, I mean, there's so much Hello Kitty. There's Hello Kitty everywhere. And that's like one of the great parts about the MTG uh, Lion Box is it just gives you random stuff like that you can't use, but it's better than candy. So instead of getting candy, I mean, this is just stacks and stacks of Hello Kitty stuff. I'm opening it, you get like figures and things of that nature. So it's not like you get trading cards <laughs> definitely a great speculation and definitely you, you get these figures and it, it's great it's great um, so the stacks of Aldric Moon which we will go ahead and put down here I think yeah, I think it, I think she's really giving me trouble there's one Pikachu here I hope it doesn't topple anyway that's good we got stacks of Got some old stuff, cons and dragon maze. I'm gonna stack here, and you no, know, it's gonna fall. And we got some more product, armed and dangerous, which is the class pack that is going on sale. And this is a very unique class pack because it also has a fetch land, windswept thief, as well as Coco. For so for long term investments, the fast pack. That's probably not a uh, fat pack, class pack. Wow, it's been a while since we had class packs. Um, but yeah, that's what we got in the monthly magic box. We got seven boost packs of Eldritch Moon, or seven fat packs of Eldritch Moon, two fat packs of Contra Tarkir, two fat packs of Dragon Maze, a whole bunch of Hello Kitty stuff, 10 way overpriced Totoro's, a messenger bag for FNM, oh, and then a hiking bag from Google. So the MTG line box, is it worth it? Not really, I mean, this stuff costs a thousand bucks. So if you have a thousand dollars and you don't mind, you know, delays, like delay after delay, this is actually the last year's monthly magic box, not last month, last year's mo monthly magic box. But yeah, I mean, um, definitely the shipping came in late. It came in multiple boxes, which is always not great. And overall, I'm not um, a big fan I'm not a big fan of the MTG line box. Uh, definitely is not as good as the original monthly magic box where they just took everyone's money and didn't send out product. Um, and I don't, I haven't sponsored anyone yet. I'm really got, I really got to sponsor some uh, people in our community to promote this monthly, not my MTG line monthly magic box because then, you know, I can get money just like the original monthly ma magic box. Uh, so yeah, what do you guys think about this month's uh, haul? Uh, definitely um, some of my favorite items were the Eldritch Moon fat packs because they were a very, very, I think long term since they are the last fat pack and people like last of, 
then this type of fat packs with Lily as you know the cover art will only increase in price. The total rows are very cute, um, and, but you know I would much rather have the gray one because it's original and slightly more valuable. The Hello Kitty stuff it is very. I mean that's where the speculation is. I mean 100% that's what you want to put your money in at this time. Uh, you don't want to buy reserve list cards or anything like that. You want to buy Hello Kitty cards. <laughs> anyway, um, that's it. Bye guys.